Yep. What? What? Huh? <laughs> All right, it's Friday, everybody. My son's performance, the whole reason why I took the day off, so you all get to see it. I'm gonna put it in the end of the video, so y'all better watch. But we're gonna go in here, and he's gonna play his trombone, and he's gonna go or whatever. That's really cool. So. another week starting off on a Monday well actually we rolled out yesterday on Sunday we rolled out about 3 30 got up to the customer up in the middle of nowhere tippy top of Michigan uh, as you see all nice and snowy <laughs> but we got up here last night a little after 10 uh, dropped off this morning it was still dark out when we dropped off so I didn't really see the point in recording because you ain't gonna see nothing. But we dropped that off, and now we're headed. Now we're headed about 250 miles south to go grab a load of lumber that we're gonna be taking over to Pennsylvania to drop off tomorrow. Uh, but I did a little bit of driving this morning. Stopped off at this truck stop right here, uh, so that way we could do you know personal hygiene, all that good stuff. And then uh, he's gonna take over because he's gonna do all the day driving and I'm gonna do all the night driving. So we're over here, as you saw, getting loaded. Uh, we're picking up a load of lumber and trusses. Now over here, as you saw, as you saw, we already tarped, uh, tarped the lumber half. The truss, trusses don't need to be tarped. Um, that's why they went ahead and they put the lumber on top of, they put the lumber on first, which they put in the center of the load. We strapped and tarped it, and then he's gonna put trusses on either side. And then we're going to strap those down, and then we're good to go. And then we're headed all the way to PA. Super excited, can't wait. everybody <laughs> we out in Kentucky it's not super cold it's pretty nice let's throw up the day uh, yep yeah. Wednesday Tuesday I slept like 90% of Tuesday away 
I mean, obviously I was up for the loading part, but this is what we got. <laughs> um, I threw pictures up on my Instagram. If you guys want to see what it looked like, you guys can go check out Instagram. Uh, put it right. Wait. I put it right. Right there. This, this is kind of backwards, but I'm going to show you guys the whole unedited uh, of the unloading portion of this load. This load. The unedited. I'm just going to speed it up because I don't want to spend <laughs> a half an hour of this video actually showing you guys the whole unstrapping portion. But we got down here in Kentucky and uh, they're going to unload us in a couple minutes. But I think it's pretty cool. I want to show you guys what they're making. Um, it's pretty badass. Let me show you guys. So from the last cut to this cut, uh, we finished dropping off that load and we ended up going to uh, the Grove. <laughs> if you guys haven't seen the Grove by now in one of my many videos that the Grove has been in, I'll go ahead and throw a link up on the screen again so you guys can check out one of my other videos that shows the Grove. Um, but we're headed up to uh, Wisconsin. And the route that we're taking actually takes us through the terminal in Indianapolis. So we figured that we would... Uh, you can't see it. We figured we would go ahead and stop here, grab a shower, all that good stuff. And then... Uh, oh, and grab some food. And then continue on. Alright. Thursday. I actually got stuff to do on Friday, so this load's gonna be going into the house. Figured I'd break out the camera, and we do a little bit of loads to camera footage, and then kind of tell you guys what we're doing, and why we're doing it, all that good stuff. Real quick before the battery dies, because I failed to charge the battery because I was lazy. I'm gonna kind of show you guys what we're doing. So we got straps going between each of these coils. <laughs> yeah, and having a hard time focusing. But what these straps do, what these straps are doing is we have them going back and forth, and they're going back and forth. So it's taking the load and it's pulling the load back and forth all the way down. And then you'll notice. front coil and the back coil we've built this pocket and this pocket is to hold the front one and the back one in place and what it's doing is it's, it's pinching all these other coils together so it's holding them in place and then what we're doing on top of that is when we throw the straps in between back and forth on each of them it's counterbalancing and pulling towards the back and pulling towards the front so essentially it pinches the entire load together and that's what keeps the load on the actual trailer so that way it doesn't come off when you're going down the road. Uh, once we tighten all of these, then what we'll do is we'll put a strap in the front one and a strap in the back one. I'll show you guys that in a second. Uh, and that again, just holds that coil in that pocket. And that's what we do there. Uh, and then another thing you'll notice too is these straps. You'll notice with the straps, when we ran it through, we ran it back underneath the other one. 
So that way when we tighten down on these straps, it actually cinch together and it keeps the strap nice and tight. You know, I'm always forgetting to turn my mic off. All right, so real quick. So as you see, the strap, all it does is it goes in, up, over, back through, and we tighten it. Kind of looks like an A from the side, or an X, whatever way you want to look at it. And all that does, all it does is it just holds the front coil, and I got one on the back coil, and it just holds it in this pocket that we just built right here. But, uh, yeah, that's about it. One big thing though, real quick. <laughs> coil racks right the racks that are made to hold your coil so you want to put your coil racks underneath your coil right see that coil racks they go underneath the coil not on the side of the coils underneath the coils <laughs> I'm not gonna say who but <laughs> I had to teach somebody that today but uh, we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna finish tarping this and we're gonna head to the house. Thank you. 